Okay, once you have transferred all the files onto your USB as we have explained earlier in the video, then now you can plug in your MMB wireless carplay adapter into your vehicle radio. And so once uh, wait for the main menu to show, then you plug in your USB thumb drive into the MMB so you can start uh, updating. But before you update, click into settings and click into version so you can confirm the current version that you have and that you confirm that you actually need this new version uh, version update. So once you have confirmed the current version, uh, just uh, plug in your USB into your wireless adapter. <clears throat> and a, system, a new menu will show. Uh, it will say the system will start to upgrade. Uh, please read all the instructions before clicking start update. Uh, once you have read all the instructions, click start immediately on the car radio touchscreen or just use your knob. And once you have clicked start immediately button, uh, wait around 30 seconds or so for the update to commence. And uh, once it has started, the, main, the menu will go back into the original interface. That is normal. Uh, once you see it go back to the original interface, please do not do anything. Do not pull out the USB thumb drive. Do not unplug the product from your radio either. So this is normal, it'll jump back to the original interface. And once it has jumped back to the original interface after 30 seconds, uh, please wait around three to five minutes uh, for the update to finish. Once it is updating, you actually can see the LED turn uh, red from blue. So just wait three to five minutes now without doing anything. Make sure your car doesn't switch off. Uh, so just keep your radio powered on for the update to finish. Once the update has finished, uh, the LED will turn blue from red Wait until the menu reboots, wait until the product reboots and until you see the new the menu show up again, please again do not pull out the thumb drive or do not pull out the product. Just wait for the product to reboot and then check your system information afterwards. So once your update has finished and your product has rebooted, uh, you can take out your USB drive now and then you can go into the settings here, go to versions, and then you can check if the update was successful or not. And that's it, thank you. Uh, the most important point is to not unplug the product or the USB thumb drive when it is still updating. Thank you.